Hey people, my name is Ohim and you're watching Cheerworks. And uh, let's just get rid of everything to start out with uh, our own uh, music visualizer. To do that, you have to press X and then delete. Yep, press X and delete. And uh, you're going to uh, Frontier. At the front, we're going to add a. Where is it? Uh, yep, right there. This. I I'm going to quickly just get myself uh, a mesh. Uh, you guys can use anything you want, it doesn't really matter, uh, but I'm just gonna speed this up until I get this, uh, until I get my object ready. So here we go. Alright, so now that we're done, we're just gonna add a uh, camera real quick. Uh, camera, and we're gonna move this back right here. About around there, uh, around there uh, we're going to go into camera view. Alright, looks good. So what we're going to do now, uh, just pull it back a little bit more. There we go. So view. Uh, where is uh, camera? There we go. So it looks good. Looks good. Uh, so what we're going to do is quickly go into video. Uh, this thing right up here. Uh, uh, go into video editing. What we're going to do is first add scene. And second, we're gonna add a uh, these more scenes. Uh, there used to be, I mean, there was a sound right there. Uh, so we're gonna go to, uh, desktop NCS. Where is NCS music? All right. Uh, let's go with uh, Cloud Nine by Itro and Tobu. So this is what we're gonna be using. And as you can see, when you play. It plays, but nothing's happening over there. Now that's what we're gonna get to. So, uh, well, wait a minute. Let me just quickly go back in here and uh, go into cycle renders and quickly just set the nodes and all the way dark. You don't need to do this. I'm just doing this right now for my looks. This is not uh, needed. So I'm just gonna go into emission. I'm just teaching you guys if you wanna do this. So this is, I'm just gonna do this quick because this is not needed for the thing. So I'm just gonna quickly do that. So go over here to uh, not there. Uh, so not, if you want to get your uh, if you want your visualizer to look cool, that's what I'm just doing right here. So I'm just gonna add a. Well, what I gotta add first is a, a lens distortion and uh, a glare. So I'm just gonna write lens. What should be around here. We just gotta add a lens distortion real quick if I can find it. There we go, lens distortion, put that in there. Uh, shift A and a glare effect. So let me just write G glare. It doesn't show up over here for some reason. So we just gotta qu uh, quickly go through these and find it. Uh, glare on here, nah. There we go, glare. So we're gonna add that in. So I'm just gonna uh, render. Uh, F12 is for rendering, but I don't have my render on right now. So I'm gonna press jitter uh, and render that again. How does it look this time? Oh, uh, wait, one minute, we gotta distort one. Oh, whoops, not that not that one. Uh, put that at zero. Uh, yeah, that, that's a zero. Whoops, uh, not jitter. Yep. Mm. There you go. Let's add that to fit and the, the distortion to a bit. And, and just put that at zero. And uh, oh, there we go. So this is what it basically looks like. Uh, let me see if I can put the negative. Uh, I want to put this to 0 0.5 and see what we get. 
There we go. That's what I want to look. That's what. That's the look I want. Uh, let me go for projector. Oh, there we go. Uh, no, no, that's way better. That's way better. So you you can just play around with this and try finding out what you want. I'm just gonna go for fog glow. Uh, size nine threshold. There we go. It looks it looks good. Uh, as you can see there, it looks it looks beautiful actually. So uh, for a simple one right here. So uh, you don't really need to do this. All you need is a mesh uh, that you want to uh, do it. So now you, now is the part where we uh, start doing stuff. So we go into animation right here, the animation tab. So what we're gonna do with this is uh, press I. Now you can have the you can choose any one of these. Play around with this. Anyone? I'm going to be choosing scaling. I'm gonna choose a uh, scaling for the uh, <clears throat> for the visualizer. You can choose uh, any. You can choose location, rotation, or anything you want. But I'm gonna be choosing scale for the visualizer. So it scales like small big like that. So press that. All right. As you can see, we got our scale here. So all you need to do now is key bake sound F to curves. So since we put in a uh, Tobu, uh, uh, I mean uh, I, uh, by Itron and Tobu Cloud Nine, we're gonna need to use Cloud Nine. Uh, make sure the the music in the video editor and in uh, where is the animation? The music is the same. Oh, uh, oops, well, we put it a bit backwards. So make sure when you uh, sorry about that. Make sure you see these lines. Pick this one up and. Bring it all the way back till your cursor can no longer. Uh, sorry if you can't see my cursor. It's a bug. And just make sure it's a zero. Make sure it's a zero right here on the line. So let's do that again. I scaling. It's pretty easy. All you gotta do is this. So keying and uh, bake sound to F curves. Cloud nine and enter. And uh, there we go. Let's watch this. Uh, view camera. So as you hit play. Beautiful. There. You can uh, have as long as you want. Uh, just press to where you want it. Press E, and it just long. And if you if you don't want that, and if you want a certain press, then press. Uh, whoops, whoops, whoops. Uh, go back at zero. Very zero right there. Let's start at zero. Uh, you can press E here, here, and it just it just longs out the time. So let's see this. Let's see this. All right. Yep, that's that. Oh. That, okay. So it's 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 perfect. It's perfect. It it's beautiful. It's nice and uh now all, all you gotta do is just render this by uh, just going to default uh, quickly. Just switch over to uh, UI image. Uh, uh, no, no, no. Whoops. Uh, just switch over to properties right there. Now we're gonna put this into uh, QuickTime. Well, uh, if you're on Windows, it's XWID. But right now I'm on a, a Mac, so it's gonna be QuickTime. We're gonna save this to our movies. Enter. Accept. Uh, now what we're gonna do is just uh, animation, and uh, I'll focus up this down here. All right, it's it's working, it's working. So I'm gonna finish this uh, off, and uh, you guys will see the end results. Thank you all for watching. Once again, my name is Ohib, and you're watching Cheerworks. See you all in the next video. And I uh, sorry, I forgot one step. Uh, just remember to uh, come down here and now my brother said it if you set it to H.264 it should give you the audio with it I or you can uh, or you could uh, uh, try the audio here uh, I'm not sure which file works I'm gonna try ACC or I'm gonna I'm first uh, put it, no audio I'm gonna put it to uh, th this file I'm gonna render it again uh, and uh, audio connect uh, MP3. There, I'm gonna put the audio uh, for the, uh, to MP3. All right, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna redo this file here. Uh, I'm gonna, gonna re-render it and see the next results.
to see if it's good. Alright, so let's do this. There's the render button. The animation, press animation to animate. Alright, so let's see how this goes.